I'm Nathan Strempel and after a long audition won the process to be a Samsung global blogger to report with video and written blogs here from the London 2012 Olympic Games. So I'm one of 76 from 20 different countries around the world, chosen to come and blog about the events but also the atmosphere in here and also outside around the city of London. Without a doubt a highlight spin there, getting around the Aussie Boomers and the Aussie Opals basketball team and joining amongst their friends and family and making a lot of noise at their games. It's a great little community of Basketball Australia. But also I've got along to a few other events, seen some gymnastics, some diving, beach volleyball, some rowing and hopefully seeing a bunch more on the way. <laughs> it's a great spot here at the Olympics, you bump into a bunch of people around the place and been lucky enough to meet some amazing Aussie athletes, James Magnus and Lauren Jackson, just to name a few. And uh, even walking along one day towards the basketball stadium, we bumped into a man that plays the American basketball team by the name of Kobe Bryant, just on his way home from some swimming. How you doing, guys? OK, I know you've all been working very, very hard. The highlight was meeting Jamie Oliver. He's an ambassador for the Samsung Global Blogger Program. He came and spent a day with us, and it was Great to see his passion for the city of London. What advice would you give to someone visiting London for the first time, especially during the London 2012 Olympic Games? All of your countries is represented in London. So, like, really, with just a little bit of homework online, you can just find some cool stuff. Try and get out of the predictable. The thing about true London is it's not really what you think it is. Because for true London, you'll end up talking to a South African or another Aussie. You know, there's, there's half your country in our country. <laughs> like, half your country in my kitchens. It's great to see someone who's an internationally renowned celebrity be so down to earth. He was always keen to have a joke when the formalities are over and really accommodating, trying to answer everyone's question and make time for us to have a chat. Let's say cooking's an Olympic sport. You're representing England. Are you a medal chance? Oh, man. If I was going against Australia, I would, there's a lot of competition there, man. Starting off with the Don, Tetsuya, you know, he's, he, he's, he's a good lad. I mean, there's some great talent there. Um, I'm not sure if I'd have a medal chance if it was cooking, but if it was knife skills, I might have a little look in, because I do seem to be quite a lot faster than most people. Once upon a time, I dreamed to represent my country as an Olympian, but sometimes when you aim for the stars, you land on the moon, and reporting for Samsung at the Olympic Games has been a bit of a dream come true.